Okay, can you see the, the scurrying all around on the outside? And in the dirt, those black fungus fuckers. Uh, yeah, I am infested, okay? Neem oil I've done for about three weeks now, and all it seems to do is annoy them. <laughs> and uh, the heirloom tomato mix that I uh, started, the seeds, um, basically there's no root structure and I'm not this curling of the leaf and yellowing is not because I have over fertilized because I was reading the fish uh, organic fish um, fertilizer and I only used half of what is recommended one time one time okay what's happening is they're eating the hairs the root hairs and they're not being a able to um, absorb the nutrients and the water they need because of see they're all on the outside because I just put an application down of some stuff that I had from back when I grew marijuana before my house got raided this is a long time ago folks and uh, I had a mite problem for a while and um, this stuff took care of them is it organic no but <laughs> I'm not going to have anything to claim to be organic if I don't get rid of these. And I guess I could just throw everything out and uh, clean everything down and everything. But I guess they can even uh, lay eggs in the carpet. <laughs> so I'd have to throw, I mean, I'm only going to do it until um, the infestation is gone. And then I'll flush them real good. I threw out the broccoli and the Brussels sprouts and started over because they are pretty much dead. And it was just a pot of the larvae maggot fly infested, a uh, pot of infested uh, nothing. Uh, my wormwood, I don't have to reseed. I don't think these are going to come out, but this is from them. It's not from anything I've done. There's certain things they seem to really like. I mean, they don't like the kale at all. There's hardly any in there. They don't really like arugula, but they sure like spinach. Um, they seem to like the vegetables more than the herbs, because if you remember this mint plant, I this is something I transplanted from outside and it was just a little itty bitty thing if you remember right if you look go back and look at how uh, beautiful it looks I mean there's certain things they like and certain things they don't just like us and they seem to like the vegetables a lot so I I'm getting rid of them. I'm not. I'm not doing this anymore. Neem oil, um, annoy them, and let them just eat away at everything. I'm putting up my umbrella and I'm giving them the bird. Yes, I'm tired of uh, being frustrated. I mean, they're all. Uh, just congregating outside um, the pots. <laughs> uh, you should have seen the first application. I mean, I put these up, you know, and was catching them even, but that's how bad the infestation is. And I've queried about how I got them and blah 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 but it's kind of pointless I mean I've got them and they're here and they're eating everything up this is the first I've ever learned about fungus fly and ants never heard of them before and uh, these vinegar things that I bought and made homemade ones of even this oh gee
got my hair caught in one of the fly things. Um, where, oh, right here. These are pointless. A guy on a YouTube and my gardener or whatever, he uh, was saying to use these for um, black fungus flies. I don't know why I said that. They don't want nothing to do with this. They want what's inside here. They want the peat moss and the um, organic breaking down material and uh, the hairs, the root hairs. This is a, a pointless mute thing. So don't bother doing that. I haven't caught one in there. Uh, the vinegar's just sitting there evaporating. Now the fly strips do catch the adults which eliminates more egg laying, but how many eggs did each one of these lay, you know? <laughs> Obviously uh, a lot because the infestation is bad. Yeah, I was, I, I threw these out and started new um, seeds and out of frustration, I, I just, I threw the whole pot outside I was going to start throwing everything outside, and then I thought, you know what, I'm not going to throw all of it away. Morgan keeps calling James. Morgan, Morgan's uh, calling me. Oh, he's going to charge me? He must be. Well, you have it plugged in? I got it to work. Huh? I got well, it to work. Putting up the umbrella and giving them the bird. <laughs>